Hi guys, and it's that time again. It is another submission video. We are today going to be starting off with Gavin, who is Geeky Lad1989 on Instagram. We're going to start off with the Bulbasaur Build a Bear Workshop, of course. We've got the Pikachu with the brand new starters. Pikachu again. We've got Sonya Full Art from Rebel Clash. And there's uh, the bad guy, isn't it? Oh, well, he's kind of your friend at the same time. Um, and then we've got Bosses Orders Giovanni looking great from Rebel Clash. Thank you very much, Gavin. Steve is up next, and Steve is a football fan. David Beckham, by the looks of it, presumably. So this is David Beckham in his younger years. Uh, Messi as well. Ronaldo looking incredibly young. Uh, Ronaldinho looking young, so that was a long time ago. And Henri. Robert Perez, what a player he was. Arsene Wenger, not looking 80. Zidane Zidane, obviously the famous Real Madrid manager now. Ian Wright and Baggio as well. Great selection of football players there, Steve. Martin is our next submitter with a beautiful Rayquaza GX from Hidden Fates. Lilana GX and Salgalio. Look at those gold full arts. Aren't they incredible? Uh, the SM210. I hope we do see more stained glass promos come in back in the future, even if it was one a year. Um, they really are stunning. SM226. You've got Grumpy Charizard, Mewtwo and Mew GX, Garchomp and Giratina, God of War and Sylveon. And then, of course, the traditional ancient Mew. Many thanks, Martin. Richard or Neo Collectibles on Instagram is up next with a Lieutenant Surge's variety. A Salamance GX Hyper Rare, which we don't see too often from Dragon Majesty. Uh, Birthday Pikachu, very cool card. And the Dark Persian as well. The Impossible Eevee to get in a PSA 10. The Meowth Game Boy promo. And I believe we are going to see some Southern Islands. And that is the case. Wartold and Horsey. Uh, I think the Psyduck takes over there. Executor. Lapras with Dratini. Marilyn Magikarp. I do love the reverse foils. They are incredibly difficult to get a PSA 10 on. Um, but when you do, it is incredibly satisfying. It's very cool for us as well. Uh, Andrew, uh, not long ago, got a Mew reverse foil PSA 10. That beauty. Many thanks, Neo Collectibles on Instagram. Adam is up next. Uh, and that is Rock Paper Scissor on Instagram. Very, very cool name there, Adam. Uh, do appreciate it here at Grady Gem. We've got the Pidgeot EX, the Charizard GX, that brilliant Tim promo. Charizard GX, Charizard from Dragon Majesty as well. It'll be interesting to see now Charizard prices have rocketed. Will we see a load of Dragon Majesty Charizards come in? They were quite common back in the day. Uh, we then have a load more evolutions, which is really cool. So that is rock underscore paper underscore size or scissor. Thank you very much, Adam. Ian is up next with that beautiful shining Mew Koro Koro promo. The Charizard as well from Basic, uh, Japanese Basic, and the Dark Charizard Team Rocket. Many thanks, Ian, for sending in with Grady Gem. Joshua is up next with just the one card, but it's a great card. It's a Mega Charizard EX from Evolution. So many thanks, Joshua, for deciding to use uh, Grady Gem for this submission. David is up next. I think he is a Magneton fan. We've got the CP6 Magneton, the Dark Magneton from Rocket. Of course, the Pocket Monsters as well. Don't see that card too often, of course. Skomori Reverse and the Magneton Reverse from Breakthrough as well. Very angry little Magneton. Many thanks, David. Matthias is up next, or Gem Mint Boy on Instagram. Gem Mint Boy also has a uh, YouTube, so go and check that out, guys. Uh, it's very cool indeed. Opens up loads of stuff. And a massive, massive Charizard collector, as you can see. The Charizard XY17, the uh, J Japanese version now, which look really, really cool. RC5, the Radiant Collection Charizards, which are absolute beauties. Charizard EX from Generations. I mean, he really is spitting fire at you there, isn't he? Right in your face. Coming out the card in this one, uh, EX. I believe you are. You don't collect PSA 10 Charizards. I think you just like Charizards in general. Um, collect every single variant. I think you speak about this more on your YouTube channel. So, guys, go and check it out. Charizard Reverse Fall. I've no idea why Flipper's on here, but I'm hoping it's because you've named him Flipper, which I think is hilarious. Gyarados or Flipper is off on the way to PSA. I will see if we can put that into the uh, holder. That is a joke, guys. Please don't think I can do that. Uh, <laughs> Mega Venusaur EX. Otherwise, I'll have every nickname under the sun coming through. Pikachu Reverse Ball, Mr. Determination. Wick as well. So, Galio GX and Lilana. I do think they just look beautiful. Charizard GX. Charizard. Mega Charizard EX. And the Charizard from Evolutions, which we desperately want a 10 on. Uh, Sonia Mateus, Matthias. Gemmit Boy. Thank you very much. Jonathan is up next, and that's with the four cards. We've got the Stardust Dragon, the Mega Charizard EX from Evolutions, the Mega Blastoise EX, and the Charizard from Evolutions as well, which we desperately want as a PSA 10 coming through Graded Gem. So many thanks, Jonathan. 
Ralph is our next submitter. Starting off with a Delta species, as you guys know. Massive fan of Delta species, so it's always good to see. Um, it's great to see the Pokemon in their different sort of types. It's really cool, to be fair. We then have the 10 movie promos. Uh, Ultra Shiny GXs, Mewtwo GX, a few of those. Uh, Ho-Ho from Neo 3. Tyranitar from EX Delta species. Pikachu Black and White. Rayquaza Gold Star Japanese. What a card. Uh, SM8B, of course, SM7, Latias as well, well, Latios, my apologies, Gold Star, beautiful, Celebi Gold Star, and the Japanese, big, big submission here from Ralph, with a lot of Gold Stars, um, oh, that border looks a bit off to me, uh, Charizard GX, the Rayquaza GX, one of my favourite Delta species, I had to buy it really early on, uh, we then have Dragon Ball Z card, not even Dragon Ball Super. Uh, more Delta Species, more Rayquaza Gold Stars, Lugia EX, Crocodile looking very act. What is going on, guys? I mean, crazy, crazy. Mewtwo GX, uh, we've got a load of them as well. Well, absolutely loads. Melotic, Jatu, and Charizard GX. Many thanks, Ralph, for a stunning submission. James is up next, starting off with a Jatu from Skyridge Holofall. Dragonite GX, Dragon Majesty. wonder if we're going to see more Dragon Majesty. It definitely seems to be more coming through the service. Kabuto, and then again, there's just more of everything coming through the service. <laughs> Burnett, Mr. Mime EX from EX Fire Red Leaf Green. Mew with those poppy dog eyes. And a Pichu, first edition Neo Genesis. Many thanks, James. Gale is up next with an unknown J, the Golem Reverse Foil from Skyridge, a Typhlosion, about to give you a hug, Typhlosion EX Sandstorm, a Raikou Secret of Wonders, oh that looks stunning from Lost Thunder, obviously a Typhlosion fan here, Charmeleon, Snorlax VMAX, the big boy, and this Charmeleon Verse series on top of that, one of the best looking Typhlosions in my opinion, many thanks Dale. Miguel is up next with some more football cards. We've got Maradona. We then have Ansu Fati. It's going to be interesting to see how this guy develops. He really could be the next Messi. Uh, we then have Kylian and Mbappe. I like how that worked, actually. And obviously, Joe Felix, very talented young man as well. Many thanks, Miguel. Jacob up next with the one card, but it is a Dark Dragonite from Team Rocket. And what a beautiful foil it has. Many thanks, Jacob. Chris is up next with a Charizard base set, the Articuno from Fossil, Blastoise base, an absolute classic, Glorak now, a uh, German Charizard, the Dark Blastoise, and the Venusaur from base as well. Seen so much base, and it's always good to see. Many thanks, Chris. Sid is our next submitter. Seen a lot of evolutions at the moment. Dragonite EX, Charizard GX, Torko. I love these full arts from Cosmic Eclipse. Probably... To be fair, I, I really do love them. I, I don't know whether I love them more than Hidden Fates, but it's maybe something I would consider putting in my collection more than Hidden Fates. Um, so if you got that far to the video, you've probably just left. Many thanks, Sid. Thomas is up next, and Thomas is a man after my collection. I'm a huge Godzilla fan, uh, if you guys didn't know, and Space Godzilla is a stunning. I mean, I want this card now. I absolutely want it, and it's a bit strange how it says Death Corona on it as well, isn't it? Hmm... Anyway, Thomas, uh, many thanks for that. Really stunning, amazing card, actually. Magic the Gathering, guys. Thank you very much. Ricky, or Pope Tatters, is up next with a Glaceon GX and Espeon GX from Hidden Fates. Let me guess, the Umbreon. Let me guess, Sylveon. Uh, the Evolution line, stunning cards uh, and great choices to get um, sent into PSA. So many thanks, Pope Tatters. Alp is up next with the Feraligator from Neo Genesis. A stunning card, really. Dragonite First Edition. Dragonite from Fossil Hollow Foil. The Rowlet Munch and the Lugia as well. Stunning. Many, many thanks, Alp. Mr. Dot Voltorb is up next on Instagram. So we have the base set. We have then uh, EX Hidden Legends. I really do love that Voltorb, to be fair. I mean, that's exactly it. As a collector, you should just try and find a Pokemon that you really like and go after some of the cards, uh, graded or not. And then I really like this tops as well. I think we should be able to get that graded with the stickers. Uh, so many thanks, Mr. Dot Voltorb. Ross is up next, and that is level 100 Dot Charizard. Uh, and ironically, we're starting off with a Blastoise. Jumpluff, first edition Neo Rev, birthday Pikachu, ever popular more, Pichu Neo Genesis, and a beautiful first edition Neo Genesis Heracross as well. Many thanks, Ross. Rob is up next, and that is Magic the Gathering. So we've got Plateau, Bayou, Tiger. I'm, I apologise if I'm destroying the pronunciation of these. I can say Volcanic Island, though, and Scrubland. Then we've got the Badlands, Underground Sea, Savannah, 
uh, uh, Tundra and Tropical Islands. Some, some very nice Magic the Gathering cards there. Many thanks to Rob. Jacob is up next with the Charizard GX SV49. The big boy card. Zamazenta V Secret Rare as well. Doesn't it just glisten? Glaceon GX and the Charizard GX SM60. Many thanks, Jacob. David is up next. Starting off with Nolan Ryan. Uh, we then have Samuel Joe. What is this? Is this wrestling? Uh, I believe it's wrestling. We then have Garbage Pile Kid cards now. So we've got Nasty Nick. Dead Ted. Chicken. Chicken. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. Steve Rotters, Boozing Bruce, Adam Bomb, Blasted Billy, Johnny Bench from Cine, Cineata Reds. Oh, I hope I'm saying that right. But it's baseball and he's obviously doing a cash. Many thanks, David. Kieran is up next with a wheezing first edition to start us off. Omente, uh, Omastar, Star, of course. Mega Slow Bro. So much uh, evolutions, which is always good to see. But first edition Fossil as well with the Shelder, the Ghastly, a Reverse Fall Pikachu, which always looked cool, an Oddish, very, doesn't know what they're doing there, and a Pikachu from Jungle as well. Many thanks, Kieran. I'm just going to call you Spark or Universe underscore Absol is the Instagram, so go check it out. Uh, quite a new one, so, uh, but to be fair, doesn't look like a new collector because we have a lot of stunning cards here, including Cynthia from Ultra Prism, Lily from Sin and Moon, uh, tag Team All-Stars, Lilies as well. The promo, the Shining Ho-Ho now. Shining Mew, it is a beautiful one. Uh, Shining Legends, it's definitely seeing a bit, little bit of a resurgence at the moment. Glaceon GX, Darkrai, Altaria, Mewtwo, Aloha Ninetales, uh, and the Japanese Ultra Shiny version as well. It'd be interesting to see what happens with Ultra Shiny. Um, how, more po how much more popular they get. Are they even going to continue being more and more popular? Obviously, we saw CP6 overtake evolutions in many ways, uh, price-wise. I don't think that's going to happen with Ultra Shiny and in face, but it's interesting to see if it Starts to catch up for sure. We've got the Nine Tails promo, Charizard base set, the classic. I mean, it's probably the most gorgeous uh, Delta species, isn't it? It's one of those arts that just sticks in the memory, uh, for me anyway, from Dragon Frontiers. Uh, Mimikyu, Sylveon GX. We then have the Piplup. We got Dark Rain, Cressella, Legend Top, and of course the bottom, Rayquaza EX, EV, and last but not least, a beautiful Espeon EX. Many thanks, Universe underscore Absol on Instagram. Luke is up next, starting off with a Rocket Zapdos EX, the Vaporeon from Skyridge, isn't it? Just one of the stunning cards. Arcanine EX, Pikachu Gold Star, and Lugia Aquapolis as well. Some stunning, stunning cards there. Many thanks. Carl is up next with a Mega Steelix EX, the Arceus Diagram, Palkia GX, alone Sand Sandslash as well. That looks really nice, to be fair, with the blues, red and blue. Uh, Wolverine, reverse foil, not a card we see too often. You might have a population one right there. Sableye XY92, absolute reverse. I think we're really starting to see the appreciation of the reverse foils as well from XY era. I think some of them are just beautiful. Uh, Marip, pre-release, Lost Thunder. Many thanks, Carl. Jesper is our next submit and start off with a Charizard VMAX, the Katana GX, Alakazam EX from Fates Collide, Venomoth VMAX. They look stunning, to be fair, the both of them. Arceus looks amazing. Oh, wow. So these are obviously the brand new VMAXs that we're expecting in the English set. Um, so it's going to be really cool to see them. Apologies. We are upside down. Uh, God of War, Hyper Rare, and the Full Art, Charizard VMAX. It's going to be such a big set, uh, this next set. It really is. Gardevoir, Venomoth VMAX. We've got the Guzzlord. Then we've got the Mega Alakazam EX, Charizard V, Zygarde, Noibat, Regigas Level X, Celebi Prime. You've done well there, Jesper. Delphox EX and the Gardevoir VMAX and Charizard V and Lucario SV22. Many thanks, Jesper. Nicolo is up next, or Nick Poke Trader on Instagram. What a collector. They are, to be fair. They have some stunning cards. And we've seen them get their cards for quite a while now. Lugia, beautiful cards. Some very rare promos there. Flareon, Vaporeon, Slowpoke, Jolteon, Slowbro. Don't know what that Bell Sprout's doing. Um, got Quilava. Is that Croconaw? Yeah, it's Croconaw, not Feradigator. Iosaur, Charmeleon, Wartortle, Moltres, Articuno, and the Zapdos. Wow. Uh, stunning cards. Dratini, Dragonair, Dragonite, of course. Charizard from Web Series. So we've got a few Web Series now. 
And Colo, obviously, a Japanese Pokemon card collector. Um, I believe there's quite a lot in it, Lee, of Japanese Pokemon cards. Because, obviously, English cards are just hard to acquire anyway. But on top of that, they, they don't have the same affinity as us for English speaking, obviously. Um, and th at the moment, they can't grade all their Italian cards. But let's hope PSA change their mind on that soon. Uh, so, again, lovely, lovely web series promos. Thank you very much, Nicolo, for sending these in. Uh, Surfing Pikachu, a couple of those. A few of those, actually. Nido King. Obviously, the original base set. Raichu, the original base set. Dark Alakazam. Team Rocket's Mouth. Uh, Dragonite. He's doing some deliveries there, which is always very good to see. Nicolo, Nick Potrader. Thank you very much. Will is our next submitter, or Zcards underscore on Instagram. So, guys, go and check it out. Uh, give all these Instagram support, guys. If you are on Instagram, it's better to grow the community as a whole and the greater gem community. We really do appreciate you guys sending so many cards. It's really cool to see the submissions. And obviously, the returns will be even cooler, um, especially as you should get loads of gems, we hope. <laughs> well, we'll see how it goes. Obviously, submission to submission. Your Dark Mash Jam, your Dark Magneton First Edition, your Dark Gyarados, your Noimat, and your Mew Reverse Foil. Uh, this is a beautiful card. I've got one in my collection, PSI 10. So uh, congrats on sending this. Hopefully we get the same result. Many thanks, Will. Ollie is up next. Ollie's been sending with the service for a very, 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 very long time. If I can get words out. Um, so we've got two promos there. The Hyper Rare and the Crimson Invasion Gyarados GX, which is definitely the best card from Crimson Invasion. Many thanks, Ollie. Grant is up next with his sealed uh, Ancient Mew. Obviously, PSA will take this out of it and grade it as a card. But anyway, many thanks, Grant. Robbie up next with the one card. It is a Polyrath from Base Set. So many thanks, Robbie. Stunning card. Gustavo is up next. So we've had good chats over emails about these cards. And we've got some stunners. The name are The Messies. The Messies. Pranini Prisms. Oh, matchups. That's pretty cool. Ronaldo versus Messi. Couldn't really get better, two better players on a card there, could you? And so Fatty, as mentioned earlier, we'll see what he becomes. And Odegaard as well. Haaland, what a player at the moment. Uh, Mbappe winning the World Cup, of course. And Limitada, not a player I'm actually too familiar with. But anyway, beautiful cards, Gustavo, and best of luck. Daniel is up next. And Daniel's starting off with a first edition Bissaflor and Turtok. Zapdos as well. Simsala. We've got the Magneton, which is, of course, just called Magneton. Nokchan, PP, Quapo, Volnona, Nido King, Mewtwo or Mewtwo, Gyarados. Right, you. So, uh, Dihauga now from SL2, for SL2, Call of Legends, and the Lugia, and the Raikou. Beautiful cards, Daniel. Many thanks for using Graded Gem. Trevelin or Magnemite Collector is up next. Lieutenant Surgeon Magnemite. Magnemite uh, from Ultra Shiny GX. Magneton. As you can expect, guys, we are going to see loads of Magnemites and Magnetons, but we do have a Mew from Pokemon Rumble, which actually is a stunning card, to be fair, mate. Absolutely stunning. Uh, wind up rabbit. We got Dialga there. Dialga again. Obviously, a bit of a Dialga fan as well. Magnemite, Magneton. Uh, there's some reason Magnemite, Magneton stock seems to be rising, doesn't it? We've seen a few of these come in. I don't know why, um, but I mean they do look very odd and very strange, and I guess that attracts um, a collection of them. They will look stunning when they are encapsulated as well, which always does help. Plus, you've got a load of modern cards here, so let's hope um, we get quite a few gems on top. Cosmic Eclipse. The good thing is, when you do have uh, cards like that, it's like, you, when, how off, where else are you going to see that artwork encapsulated like that? And this one as well. Uh, Magneton Reverse from uh, Evolutions. Magnezone. Magnezone again. Magnemite. The Reverse Foil now from Evolutions. Dialga EX. Bit of a soft spot for Dialga EX as well, but it looks like it'll dush Dialga. We've got a first place Magnezone. Magnemite from Base. Magneton from Unified Minds. Mew. Uh, Black Star Promo. Magnemite. Magnezone Reverse. And Dialga GX. Many thanks, Trevelin. Samuel is up next, starting off with some stunning old school EXs. We've got the Cypher, the Raikou from EX Team Magma, Rock, uh, Team Magma versus Team Aqua, as long with the Entei. Lapras EX from Ruby and Sapphire, and then an Umbreon GX from Hidden Fates. Many thanks, Samuel. Dan is up next. You've got this lovely light Arcanine, and you know, it's my favourite artwork, and you can see why, from Neo 4. Uh, and then, of course, the Stained Glass Moltres, Zapdos, and Articuno GX. Many thanks, Dan. Ryan is up next. Ryan is starting off with the Dragonite Black Star promo with the stamp. Mew as well. I do love that card, the Hollow Foil. It is one of the best looking Mews. One of the best looking promos, hands down, to be fair. We then have Computer Error. Apologies if you heard that. I'm just having drinking a bit too much peppermint tea. Moltres, Articuno, 
couple of those. The Zapdos as well, looking beautiful. Uh, okay, load of Zapdos. Scizor Black Star promo. Entei Reverse Foil. Couple of those. Groudon EX, you get an extra five seconds on the video because you submitted to Groudon. So many thanks, Ryan, for that. Uh, Dragon EX, Blastoise EX. I do love that Blastoise, to be fair. Latias and Latias. And Evelyn as well from Team Up. Many thanks to you, Ryan. Richard now with some hyper rares from the brand new Rebel Clash. We've got the Antillion VMAX, the Cinderace VMAX, and the Rillaboom VMAX as well. Many thanks, Richard. Cade up next, starting off with the Ho Ho. EX for lot and the big boy Mega Charizard EX from Generations. Many thanks, Cade. Michaela is up next. We have a Charizard base set. The Ditto on the dance floor. Koga's Ditto from Gym Challenge. Sabrina's Alakazam using his spoon attack. Ditto reverse foil doing some old school paintings. Charizard reverse foil. Reshiram and Charizard GX and the full art and the hyper rare. Erica's hospitality. Sabrina's suggestion. Many thanks, Michaela. Lewis up next, uh, check out the Instagram below. We've got the Shining Mew, Flying Pikachu, Dragonite EX, Gyarados GX, and the Erika's Venusaur from Gym Challenge. Many thanks, Lewis. Tim Esh up next with the Charizard GX SV49, Mega Charizard EX from Evolutions, Mega Charizard again. So many Charizards all the time. Lady and Lady. Many thanks, Tim Esh. Matthew is our last submitter with a Dark Ride GX. The Dark Ride XY994. Shining Magikarp. What a beauty. The Mega Rayquaza EX from Ancient Origins. Umbreon and Dark Ray doing some menacing stuff together. Obviously a Dark Ride fan here. The Prism Burning Shadows. The Pokemon League promo. Dark Ride EX. Dark Ride XY114. And the Hyper Rare. Many thanks, Matthew, for some this Dark Ray submission. Anyway, guys, that is the end of of the submission video i hope you've enjoyed it if you have please give it a like and if you've actually got this far you really just should be subscribed at this point so many thanks everyone stunning submissions all around and looking forward to getting these back